Hey, how's it going everybody? Lethal1 here and I'm back with another Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild video. It's been a while guys, I know. Uh, Zelda, I really don't have a lot of time uh, during the week to get a chance to really play this game. Now, um, the last we left off, if I remember correctly, we need to take a blue flame and light a furnace in order to get the basic abilities of my Sheikah Slate. Which I think is weird, you know. We started off with advanced techniques rather than the basic techniques but I'm interested to see uh, what kind of techniques I'm missing from my Sheikah Slate as I pick these apples mm -hmm. you can never have enough apples now on the way here to the lab I did see a blue light which I thought was one of the shrines that I completed and speaking of shrines I can see one off in the distance can you guys see that I will tackle that at a later date. But where the heck is that blue flame? As a matter of fact, let's check down here. These boulders stacked together look a little suspicious. Look at all those apples. I saw mist come out the ground. Okay, just making sure. Could have been a ghost or something. I'm not going to go for the very tip of the top apples. I'm just going to get the ones I can reach really quickly. I think I got about 55 apples right now. I'm not even sure why I said 55. That's such an odd number. All right, let me grab these two and then the other two on the bottom. All right, Link, climb, damn it. There you go. I just realized I'm not really climbing. I'm just kind of like jump like jumping up and grabbing the apple well, at least I got the heart okay so you can't really climb from there that makes sense why do I keep seeing like dust like as a bunny or something hiding in this grass and clouds and smoke and stuff I don't know maybe that's just the graphics anyway back to these boulders I just want to try something I'm gonna put a bomb over here. Oh, not gonna put a bomb. Oh, we better go with a flat one. All right. No, oh, darn it. <laughs> Knock the thing back down. Let's put it there and then we go this way. Yeah, it was worth a shot though. All right, now where the heck is that blue flame? I saw it. There's another shrine way up top on that mountain over there. Holy moly. Do I get the ability to fly at some point? I mean, some of these shrines are way out of the way. Aha. Wait, no. That could be the shrine. I'm not even sure. Anyway, let's go down here and check it out. What was that? Is that the quickest I can turn? That's not good. If something was sneaking up on me, I'd be dead. Ah, right, here we go. Back to the good music. Man, I love this music. Yeah, yep, yeah, that was the shrine. I can, I can see it from here now. Wait, no, no. Honestly, that is. That is definitely a furnace. Yep, I can see the blue flame inside of it. See, I knew I wasn't crazy. I saw that last episode. I was like, what is that? Now the question is, how do I carry the blue flame? Look at this, this water right here. There's the shrine. How does one, uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Aha! Uh -huh. I'll take. Oh, I can't carry anymore. All right. Well, that's cool. But how does one carry a blue flame, though? <laughs> Give me the apple. Give me the apple. There we go. Let's see what this says. It doesn't hoit. It does. Oh! Oh! It hurts. <laughs> That is crazy. 
It's raining too, so I mean, this is just all bad. All right, you know what? Maybe one of the villagers know. Oh, you know, no, I got it. I got this. Watch this. Wouldn't it be something? Can I carry it on a torch? No, I don't care about the shield. Right now, I'm trying to... Yes! No! It's raining! I mean, is that part of the game or what? Or does someone have an umbrella? All right, you know what? Let's go down here and talk to some villagers. Maybe they know how to do this. Maybe they can give me some advice. Or they can tell me something like, I am error. Oh, that's classic. You guys don't know nothing about that. Back in old Zelda 2 days, when they gave you uh, useless information all the time. I need to start getting me some meat in my diet. I'm gonna let them go today. Yeah, I think this is part of the game. I don't think it's gonna stop raining. There is a statue here to pray to. Oh, snap. Oh. Mm hmm. I need four, huh? So this is good. I don't have to teleport all the way back to, um, the other side of the world. What is he saying here? Like how I stepped on your book? It's true. I really saw her. Oh, oops. Hehe, <laughs> sorry. Who did you see? There's a girl staying up at the Hateno Ancient Tech Lab. I saw her come outside. She was right over there. It's true. But when I tried to tell a grown-up about it, they said only people who live there are an old man and an old woman. She was a Sheikah girl, I swear. No one ever listens to kids. Yeah, the lady's old. She's in a kid's body. Mmm, mmm. What you got over here? What you got to eat? Clavia. Good day. Did you happen to find a treasure by any chance? Oh, she's talking about that treasure again. I talked to you already. I guess it was probably wasn't fair of me to expect you to do all of the exploring and adventuring, but maybe we could split the treasure 70 30 or something like that. It, not a chance. <laughs> ah, I'm just kidding. I'm pretty satisfied with what I have in my life as it is. The key is to always live within your means, you know. That is words of wisdom, if I don't say so myself. This guy over here, wish, whistling. Oh, are you an adventurer? I am the head of Hateno Village. Call me Reed. Is he really? How did I miss this place the first time? Isn't this a peaceful place we have here? Don't you think? Indeed, it is. <laughs> yes, we're really feeling a bit of recovery from the great calamity. Our village is pleasant, peaceful, and has plenty of food to go around. Please stay as long as you like. Oh, this is a nice place. Oh, so this is... Oh, yeah. I remember this place. I walked right past it because I was so intent on, on getting to the top. But I want to know how do I get that blue flame, yo. Anybody over here got any information for me? Mumble, mumble. Oh, that can't be good. <laughs> Even in the rain, still gotta check everyone out. Ever stayed at the Tupu Inn? No. If you're not staying there, then I'm supposed to check out everyone who comes into town. All right, right, right. Thought so. I know things have been peaceful recently, but outside world is still pretty dangerous, ya. Yeah? So I gotta check and make sure if any beauty or I mean, suspicious folks <laughs> come around here. Uh, he's trying to pick up women. If you're lucky enough to stay at the Tupu Inn, you'll see what I mean. Say hello to Prima for me if you do. Not that she ever... Not it, Not that she even knows who I am. Uh. 
This is tough. I have to give her something. Aww. What kind of gift you think Prima at Tan Pu Inn would want? Just take a guess. It's not for me, you understand? It's for my buddy's friend. Hmm. So there's a side quest. Hey, hey, hey. Yes? Have you seen this one? Ba ba ba, Bolson. Foo wa, foo wa. Shaking. I love that bit. Of course you do. That means you have good taste. Does this game have some kind of ocarina? Uh, ocarina mechanic to it? Like with certain dances or something? I hope not. Ooh, a wooden shield. I wonder if I should steal that. Oh, it's a pot lid. <laughs> oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, but it's, it's considered a shield. You know what I was going to do? I was going to see if it'll shield me against the rain. Is this the, um... Is this the inn? I'm assuming that it is. Let's talk to her and see. Maybe th this is Prima. Hello. Welcome to Tanpu Inn. A regular bed is 20 rupees, or if you're looking for more relaxing and restorative mind and body experience, you have one of our extra soft downy beds for 40 rupees. Never mind. Come back again soon. What would Prima want, huh? She is pretty. I don't know. Let's talk to this guy, though. Hey, excuse me, sir. Hey there, brother. Brother. I can recognize a fellow traveler a country mile away. We share a unique bond, you and me. I've recently returned from both Goran... Goran... There is Gorons in this game. Goran City and Garuda Town. Uh, unfortunately, there's Garudas as well. Let's talk about the Gorons. Goron City is way north of Ateno Village, out on the Eldrin region. So hot there, it burns me just thinking about it. I had to turn back. I didn't actually make it all the way to Goron City. Anything else you are interested in? I really don't care about the Garudas, but I'm pretty sure they, they have the control of a mystical beast or whatever you call them things. Garuda Town is west of Ateno Village, way out in the Garuda Desert. Right when I was about to make my way into Garuda Town, the gatekeeper drove me off. Wasn't until later that I heard they only let women in there. Now I, now I had I known beforehand I wouldn't have trekked all the way across the stinking wasteland of a desert. But now I'm here wondering if I could have actually gotten in there if I had fooled them into thinking I belonged. Anything else you're interested in? No, that's it. See ya, brother. Don't tell me this game is going to require a little bit of cross-dressing in the future. Oh, it stopped raining. All right. Well, up oh, there's the flame. Nope, that's the shrine. I got to find my way back to that flame now. And people who know me in real life know if there's one thing Lethal One can do well, it's get lost. There it is. That wasn't bad at all. I am so glad the weather is better, but it's still, there's no telling how long this flame will last. I've never actually carried a torch, so I don't know if it'll burn the stick down or what. But I do know that we can't cross over the water. Please stay lit. Now if I run, darn it, <laughs> when you run, you put the thing away. Alright, so this is going to be tedious. So what would be the quickest route? Now going up this way, yeah, there's the water. Can't do anything about that. Mm, we're gonna take the long scenic route. Uh, there's gotta be a little bridge or something. Nope, there isn't. I know people watching this video, if anyone watches this video, is going to be cringing like, what is she doing? It's... I know there's got to be another way. Ah, right, look, there's a bridge. Oh, crap. I almost thought I got stuck. 
Camera, please. No! What? Somehow I knew that was gonna happen. All right, let's try this again. Let's get back up here. I'm gonna have to like analyze this really quickly and see if there's a way. Aha! I got it. I know exactly what to do. But what I'm gonna do. I don't know, this might not work. All right, you stay there. And I'll go get the fire. Nope, nope, nope. Alright. No, but if I climb... If I climb, I think, yeah, he will put the torch away too, so that's not gonna work. What? Oh, look! Maybe. Yes. <laughs> oh, I am so silly sometimes. You know what's weird? It looks like that there's some kind of opening in the tree. No, okay, never mind. That's just how it looked from a distance. We're going to keep going. We got a job to do. Well, this looks nice. Looks like a nice place to play football. If there was a such thing as that in their universe. Which I find it kind of odd. There's football players, baseball players, soccer players in Mario games. How can I get around this gate, though? Yes! I was I was so scared he was going to put this flame away. We're almost there. I wonder if the rafts work in this game. That's the second raft I've seen. That one's a little smaller than the first one I've seen. Is it me or is the wind like blowing the fire out? I don't know. I might be seeing things. Come on. I was going to say maybe I can light these lanterns. Are oh, you still upset? I'll help you later. That's one thing I want to explore in this game. I want to explore the little uh, mini quest. Can I like this? I can. Wait, is that what I'm supposed to do anyway? <laughs> uh, I hope not because there's a lot I did not light. But I'm going to light these. Because like if my torch goes out, then I can just come back to this. Wait, you wasn't there before. Well, I'll come talk to you later, sir. I don't know what that's pointing towards. But like I said, I have a job to do. Okay, I was down there. Bunch of boys left. Be something if it was something down there that I missed. I think I was supposed to light all of these lanterns. I, I think I might have that's one thing about taking two weeks off of a video game you you just don't remember what you need to do okay let's go up here or is it just this that I need to light no kind of looks like I should light it mm. that's that that shrine way off in the distance that still trips me out Now, if I open a door, I'm pretty sure it's going to put out my lantern. Hold on, let's swing this. I did it. Ancient Hatino Lab is now set as a travel gate. That's not what I wanted to do, though, is it? I want the basic functions. Hey, you. Linky. Thank you so much. Now then, take a look over there. The Guidance Stone must be starting to react. There's nothing mysterious about it. This is pure science. Heh, <laughs> my sweet little Guidance Stone. You sure know how to make this old researcher's heart flutter. Well then, let's go ahead and restore those Sheikah Slate runes for you. <laughs> Give me a nice snap. Go on, no time to be shy about it. Snap! Nice one. Hukai. Then, Sheikah Slate repair underway. Guidance stone lock removed. 
Now, let's do this thing. Do the damn thing. All right, come on. I cannot wait to see what my abilities are. Sheikah Slate authenticated. Camera, Hyrule, Compentinium, Compen... Whatever. An album missing files confirmed. Start and repair. I am super duper excited about this one. A camera. <laughs> A camera. Oh my goodness. This feature connects high rule command. Wait, what? Oh, so that's what those little slots were. Hmm. Room, re I mean, repair complete. Guess they saved the worst for last. <laughs> and it's done. So it is all fixed up now. Hmm. Let's see here. Which one is it? Camera, Hyrule Compend Compendium album. Yep, looks good. I'm gonna just call it comp for short because I don't like that word. <laughs> so I know this is sudden, but hear me out. Take a picture of me with the camera. Oh, and don't forget to let me see it. All right, we're gonna stand back over here. I really don't wanna take a picture. Okay, what is she? All right, look, stay right there. How do I zoom in? Oh. Why is it a question mark? Oh, so now capture? All right, now how do we let you see it is the thing. Hey, how's the picture taking going? Did you get a cute pic of me? Uh, no, absolutely not with the camera. I took one. Oh, I can't wait to see it. Let me see. Let me see. Wow. Hmm. My, who is this beautiful young creature? Beautiful is subjective here. Huh? Oh, I guess that's my cue. Sorry, I kind of lost it there. It wasn't on purpose. Hmm. Aww. Ah, it's not just a pretty girl in these images. Yes. There are also an old landscape photo stored in the, in the album. I know Princess Zelda had made frequent uses of the camera feature, but this... Hey, Linky, it draws on... It dawns on me that you were Princess Zelda's appointed knight, which means... Hmm... There's a strong possibility that you accompanied her to all of those places where these pictures were taken. Oh, right. The lost memory thing could prove troublesome. But don't lose hope. It just means these pictures could be the missing piece to help restore your lost memories. If my hunch is correct, I suggest you check with check in with Impa. She knows about she knows more about Princess Zelda than even I do. Oh yeah, there's just one more thing I need from you. You don't have to worry about this until after you see Impa, but I want you to bring me back some ancient materials. Bring them either to me or Robbie at the Akala Ancient Tech Lab. <laughs> As if my joy weren't enough, what weren't enough? If you bring us ancient materials, we'll give you something good as a reward. All right, let's do this. Does she mean the ancient screws and the ancient gears and all of that stuff? I'm trying to see, how do I even... If you bring me some ancient materials, I'll power up your runes. You'll need three ancient screws to power. Oh, I got that. Come on. I don't even want to hear no more. Just, just stop talking here. Take my materials, please. Oh, I got to go see Impa first. All right. Well, go ahead. Give me my power up. Well, remote bomb would be nice. The sensors would be kind of annoying. So we're going to go with the remote bomb. I think they need a boost. Power up time. Yahoo! For that, I'll need three ancient shafts. Do I have that? I don't think I have shafts. 
hold it. Stop everything. You don't have the necessary materials. You'll need three ancient shafts to power up your remote bombs. I'm barely scraping by as it is. Hint, hint. So, which room do you want? Let's try stasis? Stasis power up. I don't have cores either. Wait, which one requires the screws again? Is it the sensor? Let's see. Let me see. Three. Yeah, I got this. Snap again? All right, I guess so. Hey ho, got it. Okay then, Sheikah sensor upgrade underway. Guidance stone lock removed. Now let's do this. Hi, Sheikah Slay authenticated enhanced Sheikah sensor. So now. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to get more beeps at longer distances, probably more frequently. What a treat. No, I'm just kidding. I, don't, I really don't know what the upgrade is going to be. Maybe longer distance sensing. If your sensor has been augmented to search for things other than shrines, it will react when you are close to the thing you have set it to look for. Oh, I can actually select what I wanted to look for. Head in the direction where the reaction is strongest, and you should be able to find the thing you are looking for. That is awesome, actually. So if I want to find, like, uh, fire arrows, for instance, I can just program it in, and it's like my personal Google GPS. <laughs> Yahoo! My little guidance stone did the trick. Hee <laughs> hee! Oh, the Sheikah Sensor Plus. I really want to see it. Yes, quite. So if you don't mind, how about showing Simon the spiffy Sheikah Sensor Plus later? Yeah, I'm busy. I got to go back to Impa. All right, guys, this is kind of a short video. What I'm going to do is I'm going to head back to Impa. I can actually teleport from here now or teleport back here. And uh, when we come back, we'll see what Impa has in store for me. We got our upgraded Sheikah Slate, or I should say... Our Sheikah Slate is back to normal. And uh, thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you next week. Peace.